we want if we want to find the slope and the y intercept of a line, so I think that's exactly what y equals mx plus b or slope intercept form is for, if they give us this equation in a different form, the easiest thing to do is try to get it back in slope intercept or y equals mx plus b. Biggest thing about y equals mx plus b is y is by itself. And so if we can just focus on getting y by itself, then it should be in y equals mx plus b. So let's subtract 2x from both sides. You can put negative 6 minus, as long as you have the right signs, right? It doesn't matter which one go, goes first. But I like putting the x first because mx plus b, that term is normally first. And so now this is multiplied by negative 3, so I'll divide everything by negative 3. Remember, it's everything, so all the terms. So here the negatives cancel, so 2 thirds x. And negative 6 divided by negative 3 is 2. So now we can write down, well, the slope appears to be 2 thirds and the y-intercept is 2. So once you have something in slope-intercept form, it's easier to see what the slope and the y-intercept are. So if they give it to you in a different form, just rearrange the equation.